I am such a huge fan of Better Call Saul, and I am very curious. Um, have you guys started filming the final season? What, no, I go you? back tomorrow. Oh, for real? Yeah, I fly out in the morning. Yeah. Oh my God. Okay. Um, is Brian Cranston finally going to direct an episode? This I do not know. Um, I've only got the first two, so uh, I hope that that happens. I've heard that rumor, but I have not seen anything factual that it's going to happen yet. How long ago did Vince tell you, has he told you ultimately where this is all going to go? Or are you finding out script by script? I'm finding out script by script. I'm told that the wheels come off in season six and it explodes in a million directions. Uh, That sounds to me like there's a fair amount of violence, but I don't know for a fact. We have a discussion where my point of view is that Walter White became a angry, broken version of himself. And I wonder if it would be possible to write, because I like the guy, I wonder if it would be possible to give Jimmy McGill a better ending, a better place to end in than he started in. I don't know if they're going to do that, though. One of the things that I love is all the black and white stuff at the beginning and end yeah. of seasons. Um, could you sort of talk about uh, uh, that aspect of the show and how it's so different than what typically is out, you know what I mean? Like the ambitious nature of the storytelling. Yeah, um, when you say that, what I think about is, I've often thought there's no way we could do with the show we've done if Breaking Bad hadn't existed. And not simply because Saul was invented for Breaking Bad, but because Breaking Bad trained the audience to care about details and to know that every little detail will pay off and matter. So because they got everyone in the world to see that 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 could be a story you're watching, that if you watch every little thing, it will matter one day. Then we got to do Better Call Saul, which is this quiet, idiosyncratic, subtle, quirky show where things aren't running on parallel tracks a lot. And you're like, but you know, you know they're gonna all come together and they're all gonna matter to each other. But you know that because you watch Breaking Bad. (laughs) And so we're very lucky to, to make this interesting show. And it's only because Breaking Bad was so good that we get to do Better Call Saul. 